Hi guys, thank you for coming to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be talking about three different ways that you can do your eyebrows. One is being with powder, another is being with pomade, and then the third is being with an eyebrow pencil. I don't know why I couldn't say that. Eyebrow pencil. Um, I will also be having another video of this particular look that I am, I am wearing today. Oh Jesus, I cannot speak. Stay tuned for that video, and I hope you enjoy Okay, so the first way to do your eyebrows is with a pencil. I'm using the Egg Cosmetics Brow Power in Universal Taupe. I'm starting off by brushing my eyebrows into place and pressing hard onto my brows to fill it in darker. The trick with this pencil is the lighter you press, the lighter the brow, and the darker you press, the darker the brow. So it really works for all eyebrow colors. Next, I'll soften up my brows using the spoolie, and to clean up my brows, I'm using the Bye Bye Retinus from It Cosmetics. It's made to reduce retinus on your skin, but I love how it turns to powder and it's not so thick on my face unlike regular concealer. And this is the finished look. Next, I'll be using a powder from e.l.f. Powder is great for a woman who wants a fuller brow but more of a natural, softer look. I'm doing the same exact steps, just filling it with the powder and cleaning it up with the concealer. And lastly, I'll be using my fave, the NYX Tame and Frame and Espresso. I love a pomade for bolder brows and it's great for other women who want a little bit of a bolder brow because they just love bolder brows. <laughs> and as before, I'm just filling in and cleaning up with the pomade and the concealer. To help keep the pomade in place, I'm using the Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. This can be used to set your eyebrows no matter if you use powder, pencil, or a pomade. Alright, let's recap on the three different ways to do your eyebrows. All three ways are definitely great to do. It's all just personal preference if you want a softer brow or a bolder brow. And I hope you like watching this video just as much as I love making it. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you next time.